Oh, hello. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from Salads and Sandwiches of 1917, we're going to be making the pimento and asparagus sandwich. First thing we're going to do is into some salted boiling water, put some asparagus tips. Okay, next we got to, oh, what is this? Sandwiches of History, the cookbook available for pre-order now at Amazon or wherever you order books. How'd that get in here? Now to our asparagus tips, we add pimento, chopped, diced celery, and we mix with mayonnaise. It does not say how much. Now under buttered bread, we lay a leaf of lettuce and our asparagus and pimento mixture. Okay, let's give this pimento and asparagus sandwich a go. It's pretty light, um, getting a little sweetness from the pimentos, definitely getting some crunch from the celery. The asparagus is cooked crisp tender because it did not tell me how to cook it, so I cooked it how I like it. This is a lovely little tea sandwich. I do want to plus it up a little bit though. I'm going to add some of this uh, Dibeli masala. It's left over from when I did the Kachi Dibeli Pav. It's got red chilies, coriander, cinnamon, cloves, and cumin seeds. Um, some have a lot more ingredients, but this one is pretty simple. Okay, let's give this pimento and asparagus sandwich plus up with Dibeli masala a go. That's nice. Now we've got this well-seasoned mayonnaise. It's playing off the sweetness of the pimentos. Got a little bit of heat there. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Well, obviously the pimento and asparagus sandwich, the original, is some sort of a tea sandwich. There's no way that's served as a lunch or maybe it's part of a multi-course meal, whatever. It's not intended to fill you up. It's intended to give you a little bite-sized something to eat. Um, I'm going to evaluate that as a tea sandwich, as that sort of snack sandwich. I'd say that's about a seven. It was pretty good. Um, it did need a little bit of seasoning and for that I turned to the Dibeli Masala and uh, Brought a little heat, brought some seasoning. I think that's uh, easily an eight now as a tea sandwich, as a tea sandwich. Uh, it is not eight as a sandwich sandwich that you would have for lunch, just saying. Yeah, I don't know if I'd ever make this again, but I'll definitely finish it. It's a nice light lunch. All right, see you tomorrow. Today from Salads and Sandwiches of 1917, we're gonna be making the, what are we making? <laughs> Pimento and asparagus sandwiches. Oh, and you might be wondering, what did I do with the uh, rest of the asparagus that I cut the tips off from? Had for uh, post-run breakfast with some scrambled eggs and some pastrami smoked salmon.